You want the truth. You can't handle the truth. Build it and they will come. This is a New Jack City, homie. Turn up your sound component wherever you are right now. We check out the volume, we'll be able to tell what you have for lunch. The next hour is going to change everything you think you know about building your business, starting your business, and raising the money for your business. Hello, everyone. Welcome to another Red A Money Show. It's is Ron Costa here in Las Vegas broadcasting in the Reggae Money Studios on iHeartRadio. And with me is Miguel Dotris. Actually, Miguel Dotris is not with me. He's on a remote location. But Miguel, how are you doing today? I'm doing great, Ron. Great. Uh, we are remotely uh, presenting our show, you in Vegas and me here at the uh, NEBA uh, conference, the National Investment Bankers Association, where we are being represented and uh, it's truly amazing, Ron. I mean, it's so exciting to be here. 29 companies presenting. And I got to tell you something, my friend. Got to tell you something. Out of the 29 companies that are presenting, nine of them are using Reg A Reg Plus A? To, access, yeah. to access the capital markets, baby. It is happening. It is moving. And, and everybody is super excited about Reg A. Everybody's talking about Reg A. Everybody's coming to us talking about Reg A. I mean, you know, it, it is just catching fire. Fire. Yeah, it's all, it's all over the place. And, again, these are companies that – I'm sure a year ago, probably never even heard of it. So, and there's going to be more you know, next time, next next year when you go. They're probably all looking to do reggae. <laughs> but it was a good yeah, conference I, then, right? You got, you got no, a lot out of that. Great, 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 great conference. Great conference. A lot of information presented. Great companies. A lot of stuff that's going on. But you're right. A lot of people are going to start realizing that the best way to access the capital markets, if they're not an established company and they're still looking for that. That, that initial funding or, or a next level funding that reggae is the way to go. So, you know, and, and talking about reggae, that, you know, we always talk about reggae, Ron, but there are so many different components to the Jobs Act, you know, that a lot of people fail to, to, to realize. You know, there's, there's a couple of different titles, you know, Title Three, Title Four, Title Two, that are all included under the, the Jobs Act, you know, that made reggae possible, that made, you know, what, what's called crowdfunding possible, you know, but because before, uh, the Jobs Act, there was no uh, accessibility to capital markets for a regular everyday investor, you know, and I think because today's show, I think, you know, we have a great guest coming on, Ron. Uh, this company has accessed, you know, a part of the Jobs Act that we don't mention a lot here uh, on the show, but it's, it is part of the Jobs Act that Reg A is part of, you know, so it's the, it's the, CF, uh, uh, the CF form, which is the crowdfunding form, uh, that's filed with the uh, Securities and Exchange Commission. So, you know, there's a lot of different stuff that's going on, Ron. And, you know, guys, you know, you're listening to the Reggae Money Show with me, Miguel Dotras, and Ron Costa. And you guys know, you you listeners out there know that we are always bringing you the best information. We're bringing you, you know, uh, contenders, guys that are either using or thinking about using Reggae or using a different type of, of funding, uh, funding uh, campaign uh, to get their company off the ground. And we're talking to qualifiers, you know, the qualifiers are the guys who have gone through the trenches, who have gone in through a, a, a reggae, you know, that's been qualified by the SEC and, you know, are, are, are in the midst of their IPO. So uh, lots of exciting stuff that's going on. Ron, I got to tell you, a lot of people are coming up to me, shaking my hand and telling me, hey, I love your podcast. Thanks so much for presenting that information. You know, we're just, we're just blowing up, buddy. New York, East Coast, yeah, West it, Coast, we're all over the place. It, it really, it really is. And there's a area there, as our listeners know, where if they want to ask us a question, they can go to the website and fill out the form, and we'll try to answer it. And maybe you know, we should get to well, one of the questions that was that's kind of interesting that somebody sent in. Uh, maybe we could, should, should we answer this question right now, Miguel? What do you think? Yeah let's, let's, let, yeah, let's get to the question, because i really like to save some time today, because we really do have a great guest that's coming on. Yeah, we do. And, and you know, yeah, so so I want to be able to make sure that we get plenty of time to the guest. Uh, you know, we have we got our we got a sponsor for the for the segment. The uh, the sponsor's coming on. We have a sponsor for the segment called the uh, Contender segment here on the Reggae Money Show. So it's very exciting stuff. So let's get to the yeah. question and and let let's get All to right. that. So that way we could take a quick break and then come back and 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 bring on our guest. All right. This question is from Robert B in Dallas, Texas, and he asks why why um, he, where's, where's the question here? I, my, my screen just went blank. 
<laughs> Technical difficulties. Yeah. Right, well, you give us okay. the gist. Give us the gist of Robert's question. What What was he looking to ask? Okay, here, here's the question. Here's, here's the question. Uh, why is it, or how important is it for a reggae issuer to list their deal on a crowdfunding portal? That's the question. Okay. All right. All right. So here, here, here's Robert uh, again. First of all, Robert, Robert B from Dallas, Texas. Thank you very much, man. I hope that your that your life is getting back to normal after uh, the hurricane that just passed through there a few months ago. You know, I I know how you feel because we kind of went through something like that in Florida. Well, Robert, that's a great question. And here's what I have to say to you, my friend. The 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 crowdfunding platforms that are now coming online are 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 regulated by FINRA. Okay, what a crowdfunding platform is it's it's a way to list companies stock on the internet for you to be able to sell it so what what has happened is is that FINRA has has made a completely new classification of a broker dealer now that broker dealer doesn't have like a traditional uh, a broker dealer office where they have to go in and they hire salespeople and they hire brokers you know that have a series 7 license this what this what this crowdfunding portal does is it lists your the issuers stock for sale prior to symbol. So why is it important? It's important because of this. There are a few really good crowdfunding portals out there, you know, and we're going to bring one of those on with us in the next couple of weeks. You know, we have a crowd, uh, 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 Fund America, which comes to mind to me, is a very good company. Uh, Scott Purell is the president of that one, and we'll have him on uh, here in a couple of weeks. But well, let me tell you something, though. Okay, that, so what crowdfund, uh, what crowd, uh, what the what the platform does, Robert, is this: the the platform allows you to list the shares on the site, so that way investors can come on and buy the security from the registered crowdfunding portal you it has to be registered with the Securities and Exchange Commission okay and then what also what happens is 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 two things one the crowdfunding portal handles all the transactional uh, issues with that transaction so you have to have a subscription agreement that gets signed so the investors you know takes the subscription agreement they fill it out they put their information their name their address phone number email social security you know some some, some basic information in regards to them and then some more detailed information because remember the security is going to be registered under their name okay and then they have to figure out how they're going to fund you know the purchase so is it going to be a check uh, a credit card, uh, a wire, an ACH, how that's going to happen. And so then, you know, after that all happens, then the transfer agent has to get an, an email that says, okay, this particular investor bought these many shares and you have to send a certificate to this investor. So you as an issuer do not want to be able to handle that. We're talking about, uh, you know, hundred thousands of people that are going to go and participate in your offering that have never been able to do anything like this before and you don't want to be the company the issuer doesn't want to be in the midst of all of that paperwork and all of that tracking down funds and being able to do that so the crowdfunding platform allows you and then the other thing that it is it, it gives you a place to to send everybody to so like when you're doing your your reggae campaigns right you can send everybody to that website so that way they can see your offering and then you can also list that that you know that invest now button onto your website so there's a place that everybody can go one central location where everybody can see where your stock is being uh, say listed for sale prior to you obtaining a symbol so that's why it's so important for an issuer uh, to get onto a good uh, crowdfunding platform all right Robert and and dude thank you so much for the for the uh, email thank you so much for the question we do appreciate you listening to our show here at the reggae money show with me Miguel Dotras and Ron Costa you know guys we're always here to answer your questions and anytime you want to shoot us an email we're available to you guys 24 7 so anytime you know we'll continue to feature your shows here uh, on the uh, featured uh, on the email on the email question so we, we, re we really appreciate you guys hey Ron you know hey I, I really want to get to this guest man this guy is going to come in with a bunch of information uh, about his company about how they're doing their campaign he's got a different way of doing his campaign and I and I'm really super excited about actually having a moment to speak to him so you know how about we take a quick little break here we get some of the bills paid and then we come back on uh, with our guest and, and introduce this guy to to the uh, to the reggae money uh, uh, the reggae money uh, shows crowd how's that yeah, that sounds that sounds good, Miguel. Okay, everyone, just uh, hang on. We'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> 